Hi! In this lesson, you learn how to ask where something is and how to answer that question. You'll be able to use this to find what you're looking for in Japan. Ready? Then let's get started with the scene. Masato is meeting Taylor at the department store but doesn't know where Taylor is waiting. Masato calls him on the phone and is asking for more details. Now, let's watch the scene. Hi, McDonald's. McDonald's is where you are? McDonald's is on the second floor. On the second floor? I understand. すみませんエスカレーターはどこにありますかエスカレーターあそこにありますはいマクドナルドですマクドナルドはどこにありますかマクドナルドは二階にあります。二階、わかりました。すみません、エスカレーターはどこにありますか。エスカレーター、あそこにあります。Now let's take a closer look at some of the phrases and vocabulary you heard in the scene. どこ。Where? あそこ Over there. エスカレーター Escalator. マクドナルド McDonald's. わかりました This means okay or got it. So if someone tells you something to show that you understand, you can say わかりました Height. This is a counter for floors. When counting objects in Japanese, you'll add a counter word after the number. There are many different counters for different objects, but the counter for floors in a building is. Kai. So here are a few examples. The first floor is. Ikkai. Ikkai. It's not. Ichikai. So please be careful here. Next, Nikai. Nikai. Two plus the counter for floors. Next, Sangai. Sangai. Not Sangai. It's Sangai. Next, Yonkai. Yo. Kai. Four plus the counter. Next, Gokai. Gokai. Five plus the counter. So that's the basic pattern. Ikai, Nikai, Sangai, Yonkai, Gokai. Now it's time for the lesson point. Our teachers will explain everything you need to know to find what you're looking for in Japan. You'll also have a chance to practice yourself and test your knowledge with a quiz. Are you ready? Let's go! Now, you'll learn how to ask where something or someone is and how to answer that question in Japanese. Imagine you are looking for an ATM and you want to ask someone if there's one in the station. ATM wa 駅にありますか You just add か to the end to make a question. Without か you have ATM は駅にあります There is an ATM in the station. If you add か at the end, you're now asking Is there an ATM in the station? ATM は駅にありますか But let's say you want to ask a more general question. Now, You're no longer worried about the station, but simply want to ask where the ATM is. You would say, 
ATM はどこにありますか Where is the ATM? Let's break this down. ATM ATM は Topic marking particle どこ Where に Particle for location of existence あります To exist for inanimate objects か Question marking particle Let's compare these two sentences. ATM は駅にありますか ATM はどこにありますか So you just need to replace 駅 with どこどこ is a question word meaning where. ATM はどこにありますか Now, On to how you'll respond to this question. If the ATM is someplace far away, but you can point to it, answer with ATM はあそこにあります。あそこ means over there. So you're saying the ATM is over there. So you can keep adapting this pattern. A は place にあります。To say where something is. And as usual, You can leave out the first part. A wa because the subject is obvious. So the question and answer would be ATM はどこにありますかあそこにあります。Let's practice. You're on the first floor of a department store and using this diagram to figure out where to find the individual stores. First, you want to go to the bookstore. Ask where it is. 本屋はどこにありますか Where is the bookstore? Now, what's the answer? 二階にあります。It's on the second floor. Let's try another one. Where is the restaurant? レストランはどこにありますか Where is the restaurant? What's the answer? 三階にあります。It's on the third floor. Okay, let's try one more. Where is the bank? Where is the bank? What's the answer? It is on the first floor. はい、1かありがとう。いいえ、4階にあります。いいえ、4階にあります。That's it! You should now be able to find what you're looking for in Japan. If you have any questions, please post them in the comments. See you next time! はい、マクドナルドですマクドナルドはどこにありますかマクドナルドは2階にあります2階わかりましたすみませんエスカレーターはどこにありますかエスカレーターあそこにあります